first official event of the year has just begun. With secret Futurama Easter eggs that everyone missed, Fortnite's latest update is pretty sick. And the games is back from their holiday at last with an explosive update. Fortnite's first event has begun and it's in-game right now. New telescope pieces have just been updated in-game. A large stone pillar has been placed at the side of the telescope with these new bronze metal pieces have been attached to the literal telescope. It seems the construction at this ancient temple has literally begun. And when players arrive in-game and secretly activate it, something really cool happens. And it has something to do with Futurama. Huh? The giant Futurama Planet Express ship has crash-landed in the latest update of Fortnite. And it turns out there's some pretty cool secrets happening at this location. <laughs> Yo! I actually can't believe they actually added that in-game. They actually added the Futurama spaceship in the game. Yo, that's nuts. Ooh, do you guys know there's actually a bunch of secrets to do with this Futurama spaceship in-game? Including the fact we can get inside. Oh, hey, you don't believe me? Hey, sit tight. In the trailer for the Futurama collaboration, players have noticed what seems to be the Imagined Orders logo can actually be seen in a really short frame. A black and gray round circle that seems to resemble the IO's logo can be found. It's not super clear that it's the Imagined Orders logo, but you can't deny it. It definitely looks like it. I mean, after all, what side are the Futurama characters on? Are they a part of the good guys or the bad guys? And not to mention the fact that Epic Games even added a secret teaser emote to the arrival of Futurama before it arrived. The share the wealth emote was actually added into game weeks before the arrival of Futurama. And this emote seems to be a reference to the arrival of these characters to our game. We should have seen it coming, uh, but for whatever reason, we didn't. Ooh! Turns out you can actually get right on top of the Futurama airship in-game. It's not an airship, sorry, you know what it is. It's the... Uh a, a Planet Express ship. That's what it is. It's pl Planet Express ship. I haven't watched Futurama in literally you years. Suck. Yo, how did neighbor come on top? That's because the Futurama ship is actually officially in game. And maybe you didn't actually know. There's a way to get inside. <laughs> yo, it actually works, yo. No, this is no crazy bug. No, we're not breaking Fortnite. We actually just jumped into creator mode because we can actually fly around now on our Fortnite island. And we can get into secret places like the planet express and its secret location i mean literally we can fly through walls in our game and <laughs> yo they actually added the end of it in hold on they actually added the whole thing in dog look at this guy this guy looks crazy but what are you doing inside a building that's the way spaceships go so if we can fly through walls then we can certainly fly through the planet express here we go three two one Huh? Hey, yo, we're inside the Planet Express right now. Yo, dude, it's empty. Epic, hello? Yo, I'm pretty sure at the start of this video, we saw a clip where we're able to fly inside and see our whole area. Where is that dog? Yo, where is it? No, if you come into game right now and jump into creative mode, you can fly inside this Futurama spaceship and no, unfortunately, nothing inside it yet. But it would be pretty cool, but not as cool as the brand new mini event telescope in game right now. Hey, yo, this ain't no joke. We've arrived at the telescope location. And it's time to get this bad boy activated. With this location being updated in the latest Fortnite update, it seems Epic Games is preparing for some kind of live event. And it seems to be called Moon Guide. Hey, you good, Trace? Hey, why you keep looking at me? Yeah, we got one giant pillar literally going all the way up right there. And as you can see, a bunch of new bronze iron metal work has been added to the telescope. Yo, even this platform has just been built with a giant piece of stone right here. Yo, I guess this is gonna go somewhere like on like on the on the on, on like the telescope somewhere. Like me, me uh, I'm not a telescope engineer. I don't know the answers. And I don't care either. I want to activate this thing right now. Dude, yo, and to officially do this, we're gonna need the help of Dr. Sloan. Dr. Sloan has mysteriously moved into the temple location at Rumble Ruin. Dr. Sloan seems to be the main character in this season of Fortnite. She has been investigating the telescope, and now she's been moved into Optimus Prime's temple location. You guys can come down into game right now and interact with Boss Sloan. She can be seen uncovering the murals that have previously been covered up with stone and moss. We can see the ancient texts and images of the telescope and how 
they can be used to look into different realities. Both of the murals have been partially uncovered in game, and it seems as we wind up to the end of this season's final event, she's going to uncover them fully, completely understanding the secrets of the telescope. As Dr. Sloan is kind of the bad guy of the Fortnite universe at the moment, with her being in Optimus Prime's secret temple location, does that mean she's about to take control of the Optimus Prime door? Optimus Prime has been communicating with us through this temple door, but now it seems to be in the hands of Dr. Sloan, and everything Dr. Sloan gets her hands on is usually used to take over our Fortnite island. Is she about to take control of Optimus Prime? Is Optimus Prime now a bad guy? Or maybe her controlling Rumble Ruins may explain how the Decepticons are going to be arriving to our Fortnite game. We've already seen the Megatron outfits in the game's files. It is coming to Fortnite. So is this soon to become the Decepticon Temple at Rumble Ruins? Well, it seems possible. Okay, now the moment of truth. Three, two, one. Yo! Yo! Yo, look! I can see the entire cosmos from here! Yo, what the heck? This mini live event has been uncovered to be called Moon Guide. And players online have actually uncovered all the textures and animations of this mini live event in game. It seems to be the case that this telescope is looking straight into the cosmos, which is like space. And it seems to be slowly, over the course of the rest of the season, pulling in some kind of planet, possibly the moon, closer to our Fortnite island. With leakers uncovering exactly what this is going to look like, we can make a pretty educated guess that this telescope is going to look far off into space. And it's going to guide some kind of planets, maybe the moon, slowly over the course of our season to our Fortnite island. And this will be the key to moving us into the next chapter. What happens when this planet arrives to our Fortnite island? And what role it's going to play in this season's final event? We don't yet know. And of course, the major question of is this a planet? Is this a moon? What exactly is it? And who is on it? Well, these are just mysteries that we're going to have to find out as Fortnite slowly reveals this live event in game. The future of our Fortnite game is literally right in front of us. This right here is literally a replication of what we should be expecting to happen in the new updates. Uh, because, uh, like, it, it, it's not in game. It's not in game right now. I mean, uh, I mean, you guys probably saw it coming. The telescope isn't even finished yet. How is the telescope already going to be in use if it's not even been finished? I mean, use your brains, people. Come on. But make no mistake, it is definitely coming to our Fortnite game. And, bro, what the heck am I looking at? Bro, I have a thermal rifle and my man is cold blood. Bro, I don't know what kind of human that was. I didn't get any hit markers or sound effects or anything. Your bro is a creep. Oh, there ain't no way, huh? There ain't no way I'm falling through that tree. Bro, I was so ready to lose it. Bro, what the heck is up with these thermal guns, dog? I can see the raptor, but I can't see homie. What the heck? Hey, we switching up the biomes because the jungle biome is treating me pretty mean. Hey, yes, sir. Ah, uh, we good? Okay. Yes, sir. We good, yes, sir. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Is that Tom Holland from Spider-Man? Yo, am I literally about to get the drop on Tom Holland from the video film game Spider-Man? Series? Character, character Spider-Man? Uh... Oh... Bro, are you so lucky you're a superhero dog? And I'm literally a piece of metal. Would've literally had you any other day if I wasn't one of the goofiest characters in Futurama. Let me tell you that. 